welcome to another heavy metal diecast video. So today's bad boy we got here is the F117 Nighthawk. I uh, actually bought this on a website uh, called AliExpress for $80 Australian um, by, by WLTK. So it's sort of a generic, cheaper Chinese uh, type of manufacturer. So the actual uh, Nighthawk themselves, they were developed by Lockheed Skunk Works. The, the F117 was the first operational fighter designed around the stealth uh, technology. So what we'll do is we'll get this beast open. Um, it was introduced into the United States Air Force in 1983 and, uh, but was retired from combat duties in 2008 but it's still used in training roles as well but um, this was ultimately replaced by the F-22 Raptor so let's see if we can get this open there's a little bit of tape there so we will cut that open There we go. Just cut myself. We will, uh, I suppose I better put this on pause for a second so I don't want to bleed all over this model. <laughs> okay, so we're back. Um, that was just a minor malfunction. As I say, you always try and cut away from yourself. That way you don't uh, cut into yourself, which I just happen to do. So, uh, yeah, with these bad boys, a total of 64 F 117s were built and uh, saw, saw combat duties, duties during the Gulf War and even the conflict in Yugoslavia where actually one was shot down with a surface to air missile in 1999. So what we'll do is we'll, we'll get this open. So as you can see it does come with the, all, all the accessories here. It is, it is quite a decent sized unit. I'll, um, I'll endeavour to get it out. Mind the, mind the finger. <laughs> um, I saw, I might, uh, I don't know, I don't want to stop the video just because I was stupid enough to cut myself, so um, I want to make use of this light, so, you know, show must go on, soldier on, they say, it's only, it's only a bit of, bit of blood, <laughs> so what we'll, what we'll do is we'll have a look at this, this beast, and it's, it, you know, it's, it's quite large when you think about the actual um, aircraft itself. Um, as you can see, the, the paint lines themselves are quite um, quite detailed. Um, not hugely so, because I suppose the actual aircraft itself didn't have too many opening areas where it, you know the, it was sort of a conflict with the stealth capability. I suppose so. It's got all those angles and in the sort of the satin finish and everything like that. But um, we'll just turn this over. I'm sort of a bit handicapped with my hand at the moment. <laughs> But uh, those that know me always think, think I'm a little bit handicapped, so... But um, look, the, the markings on the aircraft are, are quite nice. I, I think it's, a, you know, for, for the amount I paid for it, and <laughs> I think it's, it's quite a decent sort of um, you know, rendition of the actual aircraft itself. $80 Australian delivered to my door. Um, so obviously you've got the um, areas there where the, the, the rear main gear will go. And then your, your front front nose will, will go here. Um, the sun's actually deciding to come out now. Which, well, you know, stealth, stealth night fighter. <laughs> and doesn't really like the sun that much. But um, overall, I think the presentation of the aircraft is, is quite good. Um, sorry about the, uh, the redness starting to come through. <laughs> I did manage to cut myself quite well. But um, I am not going to stop. I'm going to keep going. Um, until I've done this review, so what I'll do is um, I want to try and put the wheels on, but it's going to be a bit awkward with this um, with this finger. So I'll I'll do that off camera so you don't see any um, blood spillage or anything like that. So bear with me one second. Okay, we're back. Um, sorry if um, there was a little bit of a uh, red stuff on the camera, <laughs> a little bit of blood. My bad, but you know that shows you the importance of cutting away from yourself, which sometimes is a little bit difficult for me, especially on camera. Um, I can't cut the way I want it all, all the time. So these parts you remove from, from here, here, here. And that is for when you want to do um, the wheels down uh, part of the aircraft. So they, they, this piece just slots straight forward, straight in there. It's just same deal here with the other side. See if we can get these thumbs to go in. And um, then you've got your you make rear landing gear, wheels facing out. And there's some clear slots in there. And you just chuck those straight forward in the slots. 
and then the no nose gear is quite straightforward we'll just plug that place that straight in there and as you can see nice and easy done you can also have the option of having this um, bay door open and you can um, there is some ordnance to place in there that does come come with the model but I won't go into detail in showing you that but effectively this is the wheels down wheels down version of it so it does comes down to plonk it on the ground zoom in for you and uh, that, that's the beast the f117 um, Nighthawk <laughs> but um, no. no it's definitely definitely a good bit of kit I reckon that's a pretty pretty tough looking aircraft I mean as I said you know it's, this was the first aircraft designed with the stealth technology in mind and um, I mean, only, only 64 of these bad boys were, were made before being replaced, but I'll chuck up some uh, still photos of this without my sausage fingers and my cut-up fingers in the picture. And blood-free. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so stay tuned to the conclusion of this video. I'll chuck up some stills and you can have a look at this uh, in a little bit more detail, a little bit better. And, um, yeah, no, I reckon it's pretty cool. Pretty cool bit of kit, as I like to say. I reckon it's nice. Uh, fairly good value so yeah if you're after one of these definitely grab one I, yeah i'd recommend it there's not a ton ton of them out there as i've said so yeah definitely all right thank you again for watching and um sorry about the uh cutting myself and bleeding on the camera but i do try and do these in the in the one take and i want to get these all done in the when i've got them out and get them done so i can't really sort of stop i don't want to stop i just want to try and bring it out for you straight away so yeah thanks again for watching and i hope you've enjoyed this video and uh, if you have give us a little bit of a like that'll be greatly appreciated and uh, even subscribe to the channel if you want to be interested in more upcoming videos and hopefully um blood free upcoming videos so but you never know <laughs> all right guys thanks very much for watching cheers